<laughs> hey Zoo family, welcome to today's video. Merry Vlogmas. Early this Vlogmas, we are working on a give back project that took a turn that we did not expect. We usually have an orphanage, a children's home, in a neighboring city about 45 minutes to an hour from our home that we call each year and offer to donate Christmas items, presents for their children uh, that they have at the facility. And usually the children make lists and we fulfill the lists and we have a lot of fun doing it. And then Melanie takes the kids to go drop off those gifts and it's a great way of giving your children perspective while giving them a way of giving back and uh, teaching them to be appreciative for their life and the opportunity to serve others. This year, when we did that, we found out about a program that we were not aware of and we were offered the opportunity to give into that we want to share with you. We can't tell you too much about it because it's new to us. We're just finding out about it and we didn't realize programs like this exist. But this particular children's home is uh, included in a program that saves children out of trafficking. And if you're aware of what trafficking is, you know that it is uh, a terrible, terrible, terrible thing. Human trafficking is real. It is, for many people, a silent pandemic happening all around them. And there are millions and millions and millions of people uh, in slavery right now all around the world. Well, this particular children's home is, um, is amazing and works to offer space for children to stay who have been redeemed out of human trafficking. And we were given the lists of specific children. We were not given names and their information is protected, but we were given the opportunity to shop for them for Christmas. The situation these children have been through uh, is uh, difficult to comprehend. It touches us in a way that we can't really put into words to be able to help them, to give to them part of what has been robbed from them um, is extremely gratifying, but it doesn't change the fact that our heart breaks for what they've been through. Another thing that makes this difficult, as you will hear in the video, is that these are definitely not the lists of teenagers. These are the Christmas lists of very small children. So it breaks our heart that they've been through this, but we are blessed to be able to partner with a local children's home and give back to some children who deserve to have a Merry Christmas. So if this subject just touches your heart uniquely like it did ours, we hope that this Christmas season you'll see a new category where you can be giving. Uh, it's a time of year where a lot of us are thinking about giving anyway, but this is definitely an area where these children deserve to be cared for. Not only have they experienced what it's like to not have a mommy and daddy, and a safe place to live, but they have had something taken from them and they deserve the joy of kindness. So look for those ways in your own community to give back and we hope you enjoy this video. Okay, Zoo family. <laughs> Daisy's gonna help us shop. She's gonna help us do our shopping. Hi, what Tim. Kind of shopping? Hi, Katie. Hi, Caleb. Hi, Logan. Wait, oh, this is your first time in today's video, I just realized. It says please. What's up? So it's like, please. You're excited to be shopping? No. For... <laughs> nice. Oh, wow. I'm not excited. Well, you'd rather be in the store, right? Lip cream yeah. bolt. We're actually shopping nope, right here nice. at home. Thank We're not advertising for anyone Timmy. in particular. Timmy. Where's Timmy? Timmy, why are you, are you hiding on purpose? Thank you, Timmy. So we are shopping online because... The orphanage made it super, super easy and gave us specific items they knew we could find on Amazon so that it, it, it would just... What, what was that? Stop Don't, typing. Daisy's Diamond trying to type eyes. down there. Please. What you trying to do? Uh, I don't think this is what this uh, is because we need... Uh, so our first two items are probably for a teenager and then everything from then on is for younger kids, right? A lot of younger kids stuff. So that's what we're going to be doing. Oh, I don't see this one on her. Okay, so we're gonna go back to the next one. Ice cream. You gonna buy ice cream? Yes. I don't think it's gonna make it to Christmas, buddy. Aww. Hey. Hold on. What's that chocolate ice cream that okay. I still have? Let's go to the next she one. She laughed. We, we ate half, half of that ice cream. No, but we still have more.
we said earlier, the orphanage has made it super easy by having all the children form their lists based on what they see on Amazon rather than going to a Walmart which might only have items that are to be found at that one Walmart, um, you know, barring a few major items that are for sale everywhere. Sometimes you could get one-off items that you don't find at every Walmart. So it's it's made it easy we, to where we don't have to go anywhere, but we don't get to you know go up and down the aisles of a store and and do that that typical exciting shopping thing. But hey, the kids get to pile around the laptop and all see the items and add them to the cart, and, and then it, we order it. And thanks to the beauty of Amazon Prime, not sponsored today. Don't don't think that we just get the items here in no time at all prime is so great we love prime we've been prime members for years we really need to get sponsored by prime because we use it okay. multiple so times a week it's been many like five times a week minutes and we have six things in our cart we're all, like awesome. so basically one item a minute is what we're up to at this point how are we doing tim how are we looking not good how can we improve more shopping. More shopping? Here we go, more shopping, more shopping, more shopping. Daisy, we're trying to do and stuff ice cream. together. I thought ice cream would work. Ice, are you back on ice cream? <laughs> ice cream is not gonna hold ice up to cold. Christmas. Yes, it is. Made my mouth water. <laughs> yeah. By the way, we wanna take a moment to let you know that today's video is sponsored by MediShare. MediShare is a wonderful product. It's not insurance, but everyone who uses it says it's better than insurance. We've been using MediShare for many years and uh, we can let you know personally, from personal testimony, personal use, we would not advertise it on this channel if it's not something we believed in. MediShare was there for us when we were having Daisy. We told you that story in a previous video recently. You can go back and watch that video and uh, hear all that it meant to us to have MediShare on our side advocating for us through the process. The reason they're sponsoring today's video is because MediShare is like-minded. They are a giving company that gives back and does community projects, does community give back, community service in the city where they are, Melbourne, Florida. And if there's anything that tells you the kind of business they run, the type of ministry they are, it's their community reputation. They have a wonderful reputation in their community for being service-based, for truly caring about others and living it. There's a difference between caring and actually living it, and MediShare is that kind of company. We look forward to doing some give backs with them in the future. They're things that we are planning with them. Them. So we encourage you to check out MediShare. There's a link in the description. You can go there and get a quote for what it would mean, what it would look like for your household to join MediShare. We hope that you'll check it out today. Like, Daisy, what are you getting into you over there, huh? Don't, do Don't touch the camera. Don't do it. Fight the urge. Go. Yeah. This little girl's gonna be um, walking okay. so soon, Zoo family. She's not wanting to, but she can totally stand on her own. Our shirt almost matches. Oh, <gasps> oh, look at that, it does. Oh, That's cute. Yeah. So we're finished shopping on Prime, and we got some toys for our little kids, big kids, some kids in the middle age, and we got some unique stuff that I didn't think existed. And it'll all be here in 36 hours, and then we're gonna take it over to the orphanage, and we're not actually gonna see the children, but we are gonna be able to thank the workers for doing this and just say Merry Christmas and how much we appreciate them. Vlogmas has a reputation for being 25 days of fun, but we wanted to start off on the right foot with our kids, teaching them that it is better to give than to receive. Find a way to give. Give today. It will bless your Christmas season. We'll see you tomorrow, Zoo family.